old at eight. And then I've got some alluvial gold here. Some wire gold and uh, some flakes. I hope it's Eureka. Down there deep enough. I finally got my little perfume bottle cleaned up. Took forever to get the mud out of it. I actually took a, a little artist paintbrush and took the handle and jammed it down in there and broke the mud up the best that I could. Then I filled it with water and let it soak. And I got a, a swab and a cotton swab and worked it. Now, obviously, it's not real old, but it's the first uh, intact tiny bottle I've ever recovered. But there's something unusual about it that I just noticed. Maybe you can see it. You see it? The neck of the bottle is bent. Isn't that something? Let me go the other way with it. See? The bottle inspector must have been on a smoke break. <laughs> I like that. Well, that was down there eight inches. It's not just a clump. Silver plated something. Like a bell, doesn't it? Not sure. Well, there's where I just dug the silver thing. And then I got a tone over here. And there's the other half there Let's see here I'll get it out of my pocket you know I'd say a phone bell or a ding ding bell pretty cool Well, I'll have to get back to you on this one. Well, not a whole lot to write home about, but it's a first. There's the parasol slide and has part of the shaft with it, with the sleeve. So that's a first, I guess. I hope it's Eureka. Down there deep enough. Uh oh, maybe, but it's a tiny one. It's like the real deal, doesn't it? Polishes right up. Being that deep, <clears throat> hot dog. It's getting dark.
Yeah, there's quite a bit of iron in there, but I've got the little coil on, so Max picks through things pretty well. Okay, we've got some alluvial gold here, or placer gold. So a piece of wire gold, a couple little flakes. Let me see here. Turn it on. All metal. Sensitivities all the way up. It's stable. Threshold, I'm going to put it eight. Okay, I can't get it stable at eight. Back it off. Nope. Just a little bit of instability. Okay, it's hitting it. That's about two inches. It's about two and a half. Half inch, I mean, you really hear it. There's two inches. And that's with the positive threshold of three. Let me go to two. Yeah, you're definitely going to hear that at three inches. Hear, hear it break. Let's go negative on the threshold and just see what it sounds like. Wait a minute, I'm going to go two. Yeah, it seems like the lower threshold, the better. On the positive side, let me go negative. And that's with sensitivity all the way up. Yeah, you definitely hear it better with the threshold positive. Yeah, I'm still getting a little break. And that's about three and a half inches. Now, I would assume if you'd melt that down, I mean, it's not much gold, it'd be a tiny little nugget. So, anyway, take it for what it's worth. I'm not an expert uh, finding uh, plaster gold with uh, a metal detector by any means. I found all my gold with a suction dredge, so, all right.